Hi, I thought I'd do another video of my scrapbook room. I have not done one in a while. This is from looking in from the doorway. So, on this shelf, I have my Tattered Angels, The Glimmer Mist. I have a box of cards. I have my envelopes here. My buttons and my flowers are on this shelf here. This, These are pictures. This is just a box of projects I wanted to start but have not started. And envelopes, fun stuff. And then I have my cinch here and my Xyron. This is another box of cards ready to be sold. Up here I have my 8.5 by 11 albums. This I use for my Glimmer Mist when I spray it. Some tumbler cups I've done. My little Halloween doll. These are my cinch rings. Up in this tub here is rhinestones. I have my Xyron refills and then my 12 by 12 albums. And then we have this shelf here which holds my flowers. Lots of flowers. Lots of pretty flowers. And this is my new embellishments. We have bags in this one, some stickers. I also have cards and envelopes here. Cards here as well in this one. I have flower, prima flowers in the containers. In these drawers I have my stamping up ink pads. I don't ever use those. And in this drawer is Cricut, overlays, tags, post-it notes and then I have my empty CD cases which I put my stamps in they don't have the center part so I just put my stamps in those these cases here are filled with my Cricut Imagine cartridges then these shelves here are my paper pads I have magazines Zutter binders, like the spiral things. I have my smaller 8x8, 6x6, and then even smaller paper pads here. Notebook paper, 8.5 by 11 paper is here. And then over here I have the small little embellishments, <laughs> my weights. And then I have the little memory boxes. This box here is a bunch of school boxes and mailboxes. And then, and this is pretty much just a, a store it all, stickers, little embellishments and stuff like that. And like, little embellishments. But I really don't use enough. Right. In this container, I have my chalks and glitters, soft flower. And then in this drawer is more embossing and extra stickles. I have the like the stamping up scents, the extra thick. And the bottom drawer is more embossing powder of any color. Lots of colors. These are my folders to my new Teresa Collins ebosser. So they do the big, the big ones. And then I have a hole punch and my crocodile too. One of those fancy little things I planned on putting papers in, just haven't done it. Here are my small embossing folders and my nestabilities along with my framelits from Stamping Up. Over here is my small cuddle bug. And here are the small um, embossing things and little dies. My plates are here. This is filled with chipboard. This is also filled with chipboard and paper bags. Then this is filled with wooden stamps. I've not unmounted everything. I didn't want to unmount everything. And this one also has wooden stamps in it. This is my wall of stamps. So I have everything. These are Unity from when I was doing the kit of the month. And then I have, I have 
tons of stamps. I have Angel Company, which is no longer. I have Magnolia, I have Hero Arts, you name it, I have it. This is what I use to take pictures of my cards with. I set my card inside and take the picture so I have a nice white background. These are Cricut cutting mats, vinyl mailing supplies, and in this bottom drawer are more mats. But I have my eight and a half, some eight and a half by eleven paper down in here. This is my card I got from IKEA. It rolls. So I have my stickles here on the top, paint, my small xyrons, chalks, my big clear blocks. And then I got these little tubs also from Ikea. And I just hooked them on the side put my Copic markers in them. The second shelf here is mainly adhesive. Glue dots, pop dots. On the bottom here is tool. This container that sits underneath my desk is full of ribbon. So here is my, new, my newest addition to furniture is my desk. And I love how I have the drawers on the one side. So, on my desk is new stamps. I have Jaded Blossom, Sweet Stamp Shop, and Snip Me Up. This is my carousel. I have my scissors, pens, my glue gun, and my rulers are on this. This is where I keep my acrylic stamps that come in sleeves. I just store them in here. And then this is the other side. This is my daughter on mustache day. I love it. And then on the back of my desk is washi tape. I have my cameo that's being hidden by this awesome candy for projects I'm working on. My computer. My camera I had gotten for my birthday is there. Then I have the Ikea rails that I use to put my punches on. This is my scraps of paper here. In the top drawer, I have bling and twine. In this drawer, I have my ink pads and my ink, the clear sanding blocks. This drawer is my envelope board and my crocodile, along with my clear bags. In this drawer is envelopes and an 8 by 8 book I'm working on. The bottom holds my paper trimmer, my big camera, and some ink. I have this paper rack. It's sorted by colors, and then down on the bottom is Halloween, and that's sorted by companies. Then this is my small paper scraps, and my stickers are all in here. And this top drawer is small stamps. The middle drawer and the bottom drawer are just stuff. I haven't figured out what to do with. In this container, I'm putting my projects for a retreat that I'm doing. I have my ribbon wheel. I have more punches on the wall. This is the Teresa Collins e -bosser. I love it. It's electric. I don't have to wheel it up anymore or do any of that. This is my one of my lights. I have two. I actually take photos. And this is my big paper rack. I got this at a garage sale for $30. And my Living Dead dolls are up there. So that is my scrapbooking room. And out the door Oh, my signs, I have this sign. My husband said it was either him or scrapbooking. I took pictures of him packing and made the cutest pages. And then I like zombies. So that is my scrapbooking room.